Yo, what's up everyone? First of all, thank you for 300 plus subscribers. Like, that's crazy. I never thought I'd reach like 200. I was stuck at like 120 for the longest time. But after these Ninja ZX6R videos and then the crash one, I've been getting so many subscribers. So thank you guys so much. I checked the analytics and like 90% of viewers aren't even subscribed. So if you're watching, Please subscribe. All right, let's get back to the video. Um, so today I'm gonna show you guys my gear after the crash. So we'll see how it held up. Let's go. All right, so this is my gear that I was wearing that day of the crash. Um, I wore a backpack. Um, it was actually a hand-me-down. Uh, Cybertron, I don't really know. Um, but my friend Neil gave it to me. I got this Amazon jacket. I got this Scorpion helmet. It is the EXO T510. Uh, I got the Cardo attached to it, Cardo Pack Talk Bold. Um, also got these Alpine gloves from Neil. And I got these Joe Rocket boots. But let's check out the crash video first and then we'll see how the gear held up. All right. All right, so from the crash video, I pretty much landed on my shoulder and then slid on my shoulder and then just rolled over and got back up on my feet. So the backpack, um, it's not too bad. Got some scratches on the side. Uh, a little scratch right here. Some little tears right here. But it's not too bad. I mean, it is pretty much brand new when I had it, so all these New little tears are from that crash. So the backpack held up pretty well. Thanks for the backpack for saving my back. All right, next we got the Amazon jacket. Uh, I don't even know the name of it, Viking Cycle. It was like 50 bucks off Amazon. Um, I'll put the link down below. Um, but impact was right here on the shoulder. Let's see, it's pretty torn up. But not too bad. It would have been worse if I wasn't wearing the backpack. But the rest of the jacket is fine. So yeah, it's just right there. Not too bad for 50 bucks, right? And this jacket has um, <clears throat> elbow padding, shoulder pads, um, and a back pad. So it's not bad for 50 bucks if you're gonna cheap out on some gear, get something like this for 50 bucks, you're pretty protected. All right, next we got the Alpine gloves. Um, not too much damage. If you can see, there's some it's like light scratches right there. Not too bad. And these were pretty much new too when Neil gave to me. Oh, you can see, got some scratches in the knuckle part. Right here and here. There too. So if I wasn't wearing these, my knuckles would be scraped up probably to the bone. Um, right hand glove, uh, the right glove, nothing. Uh, some light scratches right here. That's it. And the Joe Rocket boots. 
see they're pretty scratch right here. Just some scratches. These were like a hundred bucks also off Amazon, but they held up pretty well. And I still been wearing them like they're not that bad. But you have toe support, got ankle support, like pretty good deal for a hundred bucks and they look pretty nice like brand new <laughs> kind of dirty right now but i think it's just just the left boot is messed up yep so the left boot took most of the damage just some scratches right here but not too bad still wear them and And last but not least, the helmet. I love the design of this helmet. Like the colors, the gray and the white, the orange, but most of the damage is right here in the back. So you got these scratches right here. This is all scratched up. Scratched up here a little bit. Thank God nothing happened to the car though. <laughs> it's uh... Oh, there's actually a few scratches. I didn't notice that. But it still works. That's all that matters. Scratches right here. But everything held up pretty nicely. I'm surprised. Like definitely surprised of the jacket because it took most of the hit. And you just got these little tears right here. So all this gear that I had from the crash, 50 bucks, 200 bucks, 100 bucks, and the gloves and the backpack was free. So my gear that day was 350 bucks and I walked away from it with just a little road rash. <laughs> but i'm fine <clears throat> but thank god for the gear if i wasn't wearing gear my hand would be all scratched up probably to the bone um, my shoulder would be all scratched up too um, but i had no road rash on my shoulder thanks to the backpack and the jacket <clears throat> and thanks to the boots probably saved my foot or my leg just from getting all scratched up. I mean, I did get scratched up a little bit on my shin, but that was it. And my hip. Make sure you guys wear gear, like, no matter how far you're going, if even if it's just around the block, you should wear gear just in case somebody hits you or just you hit a patch of gravel, you never know. It's better to be safe than sorry. I mean, sometimes I don't even want to wear gear just because it's really hot out, but better to just wet than be bleeding. Like, I would say that's a lot better. But anyways, thank you guys for watching. Please subscribe, please like the video, and I'll catch you in the next one. Peace.